Who's that? Ah, uh, I want to say yeah. I think he has. <laughs> So my name is Jay. I'm an Asian American, Filipino American, and adoptee. And I help volunteer at the Filipino American Community Center of Michigan, and I teach Filipino history, Filipino American history, and culture identity at the, at the center. And so I'd like to commemorate May is Asian Pacific Islander Heritage Month. <laughs> so I wrote this poem both for Mother's Day, both for Mother's Day, and also for the Heritage Month. And that's called Into My Reflection. Into My Reflection is like every other person's reflection. But as for my own, it is the constant reminder of two unknown phases, two halves that make a whole, two of who's, whose lives once crossed. Histories and histories that converged into my story. The mirror is more than seeing myself. I see more than myself. I see beyond myself. I see you, Mom. And I see you, Dad. The writers of my life that ink to my words our shared consciousness, consciousness to your past. A once upon a time story tale. The mirror is my gateway, my doorway between two existences and beings. Into my, my reflection, it's my hyphen experience of Asian hyphen American, and of course, Filipino hyphen American. The L word, lucky. They call me lucky, I must be lucky, because you are the chosen one, they said. You won the lottery, they said. Cool story, bro. However, I do not want to be told I was rescued. Adoption is more than what feels to be the surface. Promote families for children, not children for families. Promote understanding cultural history, not pretending it didn't happen. <clears throat> Where did I go? <laughs> um, because I, a product of Truman's little brown brother in the 50 years in Hollywood, in the Philippines, notions of to be seen as brown, and never a real American, regardless of an approved citizenship status. I reflect as a perpetual foreigner and a chameleon in America. And to my reflection, I reflect upon a forgotten heritage from an archipelago. She suffers from a colonized past. I am more than an import immigrant. The flea of the U.S. naval base occupation in Subic Bay, Manila, Philippines. And to my reflection, I share the same legacies of those left by the ship and 50,000 children due to wedlock left behind. I must be lucky to be seen as only brown, to have won this lottery. I must be lucky to face all the same anti-sentiments of others like me, to deal with the notion of by american those, who see those same notions they face and I face as well. I'm not at outspoken. I speak out because when I'm with you, mom and dad, I hope that I'm recognized as your son. But when I'm alone, I'm just another foreigner. I'm just your little brown brother, Asian, Filipino. Thank you. Very well.